او ساعت چوار و چوار دقیقه ها وقت دی بینی حالا انده اوینه و امدیوه او من داله هر چی لشی های تره باران چی زور لیده اوین This family from Iraqi Kurdistan was trying to enter Poland by crossing from Belarus. It was a new route to the European Union that opened up last year. Tens of thousands of migrants from the Middle East, Afghanistan, and even Sub-Saharan Africa flooded to Belarus in the hopes of getting to Western Europe via Poland and Lithuania. Almost all of them were turned back and the numbers dropped. The border was quiet over the winter, but this spring, NGOs in Poland started getting calls for help again from groups of migrants stuck in the forests along the border. We spoke to Monica Matus, member of Grupa Granica. We had around 150 people asking us for help uh, within one week. These are kind of like average numbers um, of people crossing. And of course, there's many of them who are not asking for help. We are unfortunately seeing um, a lot of families with children, a lot of people with different disabilities, elderly people, people with mental disabilities as well. Oh, I mean. All of them are still being pushed back uh, in a huge majority by Polish border guards multiple times. And then multiple times, you know, they are uh, forced to cross the border again by the Belarusian soldiers or guards. In November, Belarus converted an old warehouse into a holding center for hundreds of migrants who were blocked at the border. Many of them were sent back to their home countries. Our observer says the last remaining migrants in the center were kicked out in March, among them many people with mental and physical disabilities. They're now trying again to cross into Poland, along with other groups who managed to avoid being sent home. We also know that there has been quite some people who stayed over the winter in Minsk and Grodno, and uh, you know now it got a little bit warmer again, so they are trying to cross uh, these days. And also, I think uh, quite some people try to cross because um, the Polish side is building a wall. This border is closed. This is the end of your journey. And of course, the wall is not such a big obstacle. It's just really a metal fencing. But uh, once it will be equipped, like many European borders, with all of the technical solutions to survey the, the wall, I think it's going to be much more difficult to cross. Polish border guards say they prevented nearly a thousand attempted crossings from Belarus in April. That's compared with 17,000 in October at the height of the crisis last year.